echolocation, also called biosonar, is the biological sonar used by several kinds of animals. Echolocating animals emit calls out to the environment and listen to the echoes of those calls that return from various objects near them. They use these echoes to locate and identify the objects. Echolocation is used for navigation and for hedging or hunting in various environments. Echolocating animals include some mammals and a few birds, most notably microchiroptran bats and odontocetid whales and dolphins but also in simpler form in other groups such as shrews, one genus of megachiroptran bats rousidos and two cave-dwelling bird groups the so-called cave swiftlets in the genus Herodragmus, formerly Colocalia and the unrelated oil bird Steatornis carpensis. Echolocation is the same as active sonar, using sounds made by the animal itself. Ranging is done by measuring the time delay between the animal's own sound emission and any echoes that return from the environment. The relative intensity of sound received at each ear as well as the time delay between the arrival at the two ears provide information about the horizontal angle azimuth from which the reflected sound waves arrive. Unlike some human-made sonars that rely on many extremely narrow beams and many receivers to localize the target multi-beam sonar animal echolocation has only one transmitter and two receivers the ears position slightly apart. The echoes returning to the ears arrive at different times and at different loudness levels, depending on the position of the object generating the echoes. The time and loudness differences are used by the animals to perceive distance and direction. With echolocation, the bat or other animal can see not only where it is going but also how big another animal is, what kind of animal it is, and other features. At the most basic level, echolocation is based on the neural anatomy of auditory brain circuitry. In essence, the sending brain pathways in the brain stem allow the brain to calculate the difference between the two ears to very small fractions of a second.